Hi, and welcome back to the Mr. Brad Warden Show. And it's our third and final night of which one ship is the hottest. Now, before I get started, there's a few, I just want to review what I've done so far and a few things to talk about. So, in some of my video comments, some people do not like my camera person, what she has to say. She, they think she's trying to do away with me, torture me. Well, maybe a little bit, but in all respects, I deserve it because I force her to do these videos every single night and be my camera person. So whatever she dishes out, I kind of deserve. So some people think she's a little sadistic and demented toward me, but I guess I have that coming right back to me. So it is what it is. People that have been watching my show long enough know that, but some of the people who like watch these chip challenge or new to the channel just don't know it, but that's what it is. All right, let's get into the chips though. Okay, I have been doing the Wheel of Doom to see which chip I had to do. Well, here's the trusty Wheel of Doom, but I do not need it tonight. So I'll have to get that for another time. But anyway, couple things. This Don't Scream Chip Challenge, the name was recently changed. This used to be the Jolo Chip Challenge, I believe. The J-O-L-O. -O. So, it kind of changed the packaging a little bit. It used to have a skull, like a skull on the front and a half skull and say Jolo chip on one side and have the skull on the other. But it's the same thing. So if you're wondering or people want me to do the other chip, I would have to find that version. But that's what this is. This chip so far out of the three, and I still have to do this one tonight. This one was probably the best tasting so far going into it, but the least amount of heat. So far, this one was the least best tasting one, the Pocky 2003-23 1-Chip Challenge, but the more of the heat of all of them. So the one that I have left is the 1-Chip Challenge Red Hot Reaper. Okay, and there are two editions of this. This is the newer Halloween pumpkin-y one, and then they have one with just the skull. I believe they're the same ingredients and same heat, but I'll have to check into that just to make sure. But this is the newer edition for your Halloween edition, Red Hot Reaper. It has uh, Carolina Reaper and Trinidad Scorpion, like the other Pocky One Chip Challenge. It says, try if you dare. Inside the box, one extremely hot tortilla chip. All right, so I will crack the seal here. If I can, I should add my trusty scissors just in case, or maybe I can pull it off. Yeah, there we go. I might have it here. Some of those thicker tapes. All right, I just ripped it right off. All right, the Red Hot Reaper. Okay, here it is. Oh, it has a glove just in case, but I don't need a glove because I didn't use gloves on the other one. So I'm not going to worry too much about that. And it has instructions, let's see. It has how long you can last, one minute newbie, three minutes beginner, five minutes pro, 10 minutes legend. Um, prepare, step one, prepare some milk or soft drink. Step two, wear a glove provided to eat the chip. Step three, share your video on Red Hot Reaper UK. Hmm. UK, maybe it's out of the UK then. I didn't catch up before. Maybe it's a uh, product of the UK. Red Hot Reaper UK. Um, I did not do step one. I did not prepare milk or a soft drink. I am not going to wear the glove step two. And I'll see about this whole sharing thing. But eat at your own risk. Not everybody will enjoy this extreme heat. Do not eat if you're sensitive to spicy food, allergic to peppers or capsaicin. If you are pregnant or medical condition, do not eat this chip. Makes sense. Keep out of reach of children. Yeah, you should not be eating these generally unless you're over 18 years old. Any of these three chips, unless you have an extremely high heat tolerance and you know it. But don't, don't eat these at school, kiddies, because that's how these things get banned when people just dare each other to eat them. And then they end up in like the hospital thinking they're having issues when really you're not. You just have to face through the pain. First, the mouth pain and sometimes stomach pain too. Sometimes it makes you a little sick. So um, what to expect? Mouth on fire, runny nose, watery eyes, and a lot of 
F words like fun, fiery, frying, family friendly. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Can All right. We, can we see the decade? Oh, you want to see the. Just thing? the back part. All right. So here's what it has on the card. That's like the uh, one instructions. And then on the other side, the rules and the time limits and stuff. So again, I don't know if I'll wait the full 10. This one only has you waiting 10, whereas the Pocky One Trip Challenge has you waiting up to an hour. I don't wait that long because the heat is really coming down. Now here's the chip itself. The chip is in a nice little package. It is closer to the size of the Jolo or Don't, Don't Scream Chip Challenge. It's a smaller one. The Pocky Chip's about twice as big as either one of these. It looks totally fully coated again. And from what people said, this one tastes, I guess, better, but I'll taste, oh, it's really sealed. I'm going to need my trusty scissors, probably. Unless I can, oh, maybe, no, no, maybe there's, a, oh, no, there's a little popping seal on top. So here we go, bare-handed, it's in one tact. It's almost like your uh, tortilla chip that you'd pull out of like a Dorito. It is super duper coated here. Let's see it forming. So it would be like about the size of your Dorito chip. All right, here we go. The one chip challenge, the Red Hot Reaper edition. Will it taste better? Will it be hotter? We'll soon find out. Hmm. It's not too cheesy, but it's very um reaper forwardy too. Hmm, that sounds good. All right. I don't know. This one might be the hottest. Really? So far before the build. It's pretty hot. And flavor wise, it's got that little nacho cheese in it, which makes it good. Flavor wise, I'm gonna say it's probably the best, probably a little bit better than this. Flavor wise for Chili Head, I would say it's probably about a, <clears throat> probably about a six to a 10. For flavor or heat? For flavor. It is definitely, definitely a 10 out of 10 for an average person. And right now, it's already hotter than this. I'd say I'd probably add like a chili head. At least a good three. And it's climbing, so it's going to be ballparking this. The Pocky 2023. It's still kind of building a little bit. It hits this one. Some of them, the Pocky chip... <sighs> Hits you more in the lips and mouth. This one is hitting me more in the throw it bad. When it actually gave me hiccups a little bit. Hmm. Most time spicy challenges don't, but this one did a little. Is that kind of like trouble bubble juice in your throat more? Kinda. Wow. Does that one have capsaicin? This one? Ooh, hiccups. Or like, you know what I'm talking about? Ooh. Has scorpion and hip. Oh, Reaper. I've never seen you get hiccups before. Yeah, I don't know. I rarely, rarely get hiccups from spicy stuff, but. That's wild. Yeah, so much pretty <clears throat> hot. It's really burning the throat. It's definitely got a hotter throat burn than the other ones by far. Um. Yeah, I don't know. I almost want to say this is the hottest one. Probably at about a four. And those knives are starting to get going. Whoo! And I think it's probably about peaked at about a four for a chili head. But that throw-up burn is nasty. 
turn the back of the mouth and throw it. So, let me rate them on. I'm definitely the hottest. Let me rate them. Ah! It's hard for me to get words though because I'm hiccuping so bad. Gotta hold your breath, man. This one, the Don't Stream Chip Challenge or Jolo Chip is the least hot. Rated that a 2 out of 10 for Chili Head. Pocky One Chip Challenge 2023. I always struggle between a 3 and a 4, so I'll give it a 3.5 on heat for a Chili Head. And this one, because the astronomical throw burn. I'm going to say this is a 4 out of 10 for a chili head, making truly the one chip challenge Red Hot Reaper the hottest one chip challenge out there on the market. You can get yours on Amazon. It's smaller, tastes better, and actually this one also tastes the best too. It's the hottest and it ta uh, tastes the best out of all of the one chip challenges. Pocky, I think, is still the worst tasting. Although, don't get me wrong, the 2023 I thought was the um, best flavor out of all the years of Pocky, but still the other two one chip challenges are better flavored than the Pocky. He's not subsiding, but I still have the hiccups a bit, or they might be subsiding a little too. So if you stuck around to watch it, <sighs> flavor-wise, here's the rating. Pocky least. Joe Lord, don't scream in the middle. Here's the flavor rating, least, middle, best. Heat rating would be this. Least, worst, best. If you want the best burn. But all of them are going to give you a good burn. Like I said, if you're under 18 or do not have any heat tolerance at all, buyer beware. Please don't do them at school because you might not make it through school that day. Um, if you want a good burn, go ahead and give them a shot. Also, don't get me wrong either. My response on this one was a little, probably a little higher than the other ones, but... These all three are going to be a 10 out of 10 for an average person. Somebody who just eats a little spicy food here or there doesn't eat spicy. You would get lit up from either one of these three here. With this one being the worst. Pocky, this here's going to light you up pretty good. And this one here. The Don't Scream Chip or Jolo Chip Challenge. So, I'm at about six minutes. For me as a chili head, by this time the heat's subsiding. But don't get me wrong, the back of my mouth and throw it still burn very, very solidly right now. It'll take a while for that to come down, I think. I think this one lasted the longest, too. So that's my rating on which is the hottest chip. Here you go, folks at home. Have it. The, the um, Not the Pocky, the One Chip Challenge Red Hot Reaper. As of right now, it's the hottest. There might be one chip out there too yet yeah, that's made just for chili heads. Um, that might be a lot hotter. I think they made a chip too, which I haven't had yet, that it has um, 16 million um, extract in it too, which would probably make it the hottest. I don't believe any of these have extract in. I think they're just all the hot peppers, probably putting all these in the 2 million um, Scoville unit ballpark. But extremely coated with peppers, so they are going to be bad, too. All right, so that is my assessment on which Pocky Chip, I mean, not Pocky Chip, which one ship challenge is the hottest. All right, hope you enjoyed. We'll be on to something um, new and different tomorrow, or another taste tester review. And we'll see you next time. Have a good rest of your weekend here on the Mr. Brad Warden Show.